doesn't seem like a place you find good men! We're not looking for good men. We're looking for mercenaries. We have no hope of taking the fortress without them. If we make it far enough to hire them, with those things out there... These bones! This place has swallowed things larger than us! Oh, They'll kill us all! Run! Get off the sand! It's all sand! Well, Keep calm! Keep moving! Where? Anywhere that isn't sad! I was hoping it wasn't a corpse I was dragging home. <clears throat> bit, a bit weird, that, eh? <laughs> My man, <clears throat> what happened? Uh, I'm sorry, lad. They weren't as lucky as you. Thank you for saving me. Oh, you don't thank me. Uh, thank this. <clears throat> that little darling's a bit twitchy, but she should get you up to my camp, no trouble. I've uh, got a newer one for myself. Worked out all the hitches. Hitches? Word of advice about the climb. If you don't like heights, don't look down. And if you don't like dwarf asses, don't look up. <sighs> this device! You built it? You don't need to flatter me, lad. I already snatched you from the nasties. No, what you got there's Numenorian. Loads of their contrivances scattered around from way back. Very useful. Trick is, grabbing it without the worms grabbing you. I found a few promising sites, got them all sketched out. You bring what you find back to me, I'll tinker till it does what it used to. Or does something, anyway. Then you can field test it. Make sure it's safe. Sound good? More than fair. Convenient spot if you're moving in furniture. But on the plus side, worms don't like heights. So, what are you doing so far from Gondor? Looking for the Vanishing Sons. They're a mercenary company. Yes, I hired a few of them to look for Numenorian bits. Now I owe their leader a few. <clears throat> Mercenaries. I've got just the thing to get you to where they are. Just don't tell them where I am. What do I do? Just run off the edge of the cliff. Run off the edge of the cliff? And here, these are the places to poke around for more Numenorean goodies. Go on then. I've used this thing myself. Not a bump or a scratch. Whatever you do, don't! Oh, 
you'll figure it out. Figure what out? All right, this... this is... Whoa! Just have to not think about it, is all. Right. Getting the hang of it. You ever see that dwarf running around in the desert? The one with all the toys? My name is Berano. I am second captain of the Gondorian Guard at Minas Ethel. Minas Ethel has fallen some time ago, I believe. I am seeking soldiers. Well, it's difficult to be a captain without them. Lucky for you, I've got the finest warriors in all of Middle Earth! <laughs> Do you carry coin of any kind? Some. Some. You're going to need a lot more than some. <laughs> What are your plans for the raid? I assume you're not planning to retake Minas Ethel. I'm planning to take Shindrum. The fortress? No, 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 no. <laughs> that sounds like the work for heroes. All I can offer you are mercenaries. Look, why don't you come back when you have some more money? Or sense? What art? How do you know that name? You haven't changed! I remember a boy of seven, small for his age, so he had a lot to prove. And one day, he decided that he was going to explore the caves of Umbar, but he got himself into a little bit of trouble. Lucky for him, he had a brother, a beautiful, courageous older brother who was sent to look for him. And by the time that champion reached him, he was moments away from being devoured by Karagors. <laughs> Karagors? Jagai? No, 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 little brother. I... I am Serka now. Serka, the unkillable. Serka, the insufferable. Serka, the survivor. But I still bear some scars from my former life. How did you come to be here? Among these Easterlings? Same old story. A village is raided, homes are looted, mothers and fathers are slaughtered, screaming tears. Orcs. Mercenaries. 
How is it? I should be thankful, though, of course, eh? Not every boy gets the chance to be raised among such a merry band of killers and thieves! <laughs> but you lead them. Yeah, only until I get a knife in my back. And believe me, that is how all leaders end up. But enough history. Blood only goes so far. You and I, we have business to transact. If I'm going to take that fortress, I better start with something smaller. Let's see about those outposts. Like to fight. If there aren't any men around, then fight each other. This was <clears throat> something about a raid leading a massive 